You know what I just realized? Today is really a weird day. Today is... I don't know, that bugs me a little bit. That's kind of creepy. But yeah, today is 1-1-1-1-1. One, 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 one. Kind of interesting. So I was sitting here thinking about what I was going to talk to you guys about today, and um, I realized that there's a couple of goals that I want to accomplish. Uh, maybe not so much this year, but just in general. Uh, one of the things that I would love to do is travel more. It's something that's come up a lot lately, and um, I'm actually excited about doing a little bit more traveling. And um, one of the places that I would love to go is where my dad is from. My dad is originally from Honduras, and uh, he's from a little uh, city called Tila, Honduras, and that's where he was born. And I would love to go there one day. I think it would be amazing to see where he was actually uh, from. Uh, this is Tila right here. So yeah, that's that's it, and I would love to check that out. I'd also like to go to Europe at one point in my life. I think that would be absolutely amazing. Um, yeah, so goals. What kind of goals do I want to accomplish? I definitely am looking forward to doing more songwriting this year, and that's why I have this out today. Uh, obviously, with the Every 7 Day Project, I'm going to be doing a little bit more songwriting, a little bit, a lot more songwriting than than in past years, so that should be interesting. I also just need to um, keep on track with my dieting and my exercise and all of that fun stuff. But yeah, I definitely want to tap into my more creative side this year, and I'm really looking forward to that. So I was looking through one of my song books, one of my um, poetry books, and this was another one that I never uh, actually put into, into uh, music, but I just thought it was kind of interesting. Like I said, it was... Uh, very tumultuous time in my life and um, just wasn't really happy but I really like this one and I wanted to share it with you guys so this is called If I Was and <clears throat> I have no idea on the date of this one um, yeah no there is no there's no anything saying where where this is from but uh, this is called If I Was and it goes like this if I was more like the person you wanted me to be if I looked more like everyone else, if I was more out for myself, would you be drawn to me? Why do I even bother? Because you'll never see. Take me or leave me. I am what I am. If I was more like you, then maybe I would understand how to step over people, have all placed right in your hand. If I was more like you, it would help me to realize how I got wise and how I'm not like you. Spinning my wheels, talking to you, I don't know why I try. You're looking right at me. You look me right in the eyes, but you don't hear one thing I'm telling you. Yeah, like I said, <laughs> it was a very interesting time in my life. Oh, apparently there's a second page to this. And then it, the second page is, sometimes you just have to let go. You just want more, but you just don't know. Let the day take you to another time and place because it feels like we are losing this race. It's kind of interesting. I just thought that was, uh, I read that and I just, I thought, wow, it's kind of neat. I really, uh, like I said, I really was not a happy camper at that time of my life. But uh, I can't wait to actually sit down and go through this stuff and maybe start putting some of it to music. But we'll see. If nothing else, I'll have good poetry for the year to share with you guys. And um, that's pretty much all I got for today. And I'll see you tomorrow.